Okay, we're going to have a seat in the clipper bar as we didn't get the time to do this this time. So we're going to have a look in the clipper bar as the bar 19. This is the one that you could see from our room last time because it's got the gray green grass on top. So our room last time was on floor 14 up there. So like I say, so we're just having a look around and see what see what they got. Oh, the bar. Excuse me. <laughs> Hello and I'm their host for today evening. My name is Mihir. I'm the assistant bars manager. Excellent. Lovely to Pleasure. have you both. Pleasure Please to meet come you. Show. Look at a nice view. Yeah. Here as well. Oh, oh. bar very nice. Yeah? Yeah, seat's nice. Let's see if we can get a sunset at a different level today, is it? Hi. Hi, it's Miss Rapture. Hi, it's Joseph. It's a pleasure to see you all. It's a pleasure to see you all. So, what type of drinks do you have here? How many? Do you, obviously, you've got loads here. Yes. We do have, <laughs> we do have many gin, we have spirits, we have, you know, a lot of the, around the world cocktails. we have Many cocktails, <laughs> so we do many uh, signature cocktails. Yeah. Our like signature, we found only here and some specific cocktails. Here's the best water. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, so, you love your job here? Yeah, yeah you love it, yeah? I love job. Uh, we have a good team fantastic, yeah. 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 I see you have a good team, yes. Yeah. So um, thank you for serving us this evening, you've been absolutely amazing and I will definitely come back and s uh, see you again and we will post this vlog uh, for a week's time and we'll send it to the guest relations team. Oh, wow. So uh, you, you will definitely be on our vlog. Yeah, sure. <laughs> so thank you very much. <laughs> Sunset outside, we'll be heading up to the bar 18 later. Yeah. Claire hasn't brushed her hair, never mind. Yeah. <laughs> and for a change, we're going to try some uh, room service. So we've got some chicken, chicken fajita wraps, some chips, and some nachos. So we'll see how that goes down now. <laughs> Looks like it's going on very well. <laughs> See, chicken fajitas, mm. messy but nice. Mm. The only problem is, is that they're very hot but very very tasty. Mm. See, she's like eating with an animal on the road. I'm telling you now. <laughs> On a lunch last lunch and meeting, she wasn't eating like that, but look at her now, she's gone fair aisle now. I'm stopping. <laughs> <laughs> <David>. What? <coughs> what I could remember is that we have a speaker in the bathroom, Bose. So that when you turn the telly down here, it plays in there. So you know, I've got to turn the telly off now for a minute while we do this final bit of the luncheon vlog. Luncheon was very nice. We have decided we can't eat two meals. So that'd be like, we're like my parents now, you have to have one between us. <laughs> Which is a good thing. Mm. But the food? Mm, excellent standard. Really, really lovely, tasteful. I'm plentiful, but oh my goodness, too much for me. You ordered too much. I ordered too much, yes. <laughs> my own fault. Yes. <clears throat> so there we are. So that was the evening meal on the room service trial. And like I say, but when Claire ordered too much, very, very nice. Mm. Good morning from sunny London. Uh, Claire's going to get the key of the new room because apparently the 
12 hours the hotel wishes us to have the full experience so we've got the upgrade room last time we've got the normal room this time and now they're going to give us another room to see what see what the, the comparison in the comparison the comparison is so Kelly's going to get the keys now and then we'll be moving to another room then we're going to have a look around uh, Greenwich and have a vlog of what's around Greenwich this today um, like I say the room we're in is currently tidy you know it's a, not bad at all a little bit smaller than the one we had last time but like I say we've had the the porridge now we've got the small medium and now we're going to have a another one now which apparently it's room 1420 so we'll see what that one's like for those of you who think this corridor looks familiar we stayed in 1434 last time with that view and now tonight we've been moved to 1431 which is this room it's got a double walking wardrobe. Let's do the bathroom first. Let's find the lights first. Let's look at the lights on. Yeah, there's the lights. We've got a shower, bath, and bathroom is identical to the one we just left. The room we just left, and the room we were in earlier. We've got a complete tea and coffee area, a sofa, and table. And the difference is is that we've got a writing desk in the corner we have a nice view over the whole of the O2 and the Thames and you can even see the cable car in the distance and you can see over as far as the, the hills in the distance over there as well and if you look out this window here as you get to the curtains you can see the Thames from a different angle on the front as well like I say, so it's a whole new aspect. Got a self drive mirror, telly in the corner, which is interesting. And we've got a massive, massive posh bed with bedspread and pillows to match. So, what room is this, dear? Uh, so, this is a suite, uh, a junior suite. Uh, it's a it's uh, obviously a, a nice, very good upgrade. Thank you very much to the team. Um, it's really nice, so uh, well pleased. And um, thank you to the Intercontinental team. And like I say, we've had an overview now of every room in the yeah. Intercontinental. So we've slept Except in the... Except the presidential suite. Ah, we've slept <laughs> all, the, all, all, all the normal <laughs> affordable rooms. Yes, exactly. We've, uh, managed to, we've managed to use the... We've gone through the normal room. Which we were in last night, we had the upgrade, which was the vlog before. Yeah. And now we've got the junior suite, which is the room we're in now. And like I say, the. Um, this is probably our. This is probably our sort of like uh, limit for us. <laughs> uh, but you never know in the future if uh, our channel grows uh, with your help, then uh, you never know. So thank you very much. So like I said, we're going for a wander around, going for a wander around Greenwich now, and uh, then hopefully come back and use the spa for a for the time being, and we're going to do a vlog over towards the get over towards the bike shed as well this afternoon. Let's catch you in a minute. I've been going crazy, I don't know what to do My heart is screaming for you, babe And what I'm trying to say is that you make the sky look blue Even when it is grey, babe Every time I'm feeling down, you can make it go away Your light is shining bright on me Got no reason to be afraid Glowing in the dark, glowing in the dark I feel it in my heart You're glowing in the dark, glowing in the dark Yeah, you're glowing in the dark
the northern Greenwich now on the peninsula. There's our ride for the day. We're going to catch the boat down to Greenwich. The cable car that goes across to the Excel Centre. We've just passed a very musical fence. That was uh, the first time I came here. All of this was not developed. It was a now it's a massive flats and everything else. We're on the clipper. One of the story of the day is it's always got air conditioning. <laughs> You'll check back in in Greenwich or Greenwich, whatever you want to say. <laughs> We're now approaching Greenwich and in the distance you can see the Cuddy Sark, the dome building in front of you. Here's a walkway under the Thames that comes out on the other side. Uh, worth a walk if you fancy a mile of walk. Um, we didn't get time to do it this time but we will be doing it next time. And in the distance we have the Cuddy Sark which is the fastest uh, tea clipper of its time. And it was run between Australia and the UK and it was built in Levin, on the River Levin in Dumbarton in 1869. So, past the ships of its time. Naval College. Do you want to look in the Naval College here? No. It's a water alley. Find a nice little <laughs> coffee, come back. Who <laughs> laughing at you? Uh, yeah, find a nice little coffee, come back place in the centre of Greenwich. Very, very quaint. Oh, and more to the point, double espresso that doesn't make you shiver. Yeah. Very nice coffee. How it's you be a first. Yeah, I was gonna <laughs> say, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm happy. I, a nice place, the old brewery we found here in the wall gardens. Very nice, very, very, very nice. And it's not crowded, no. it's not all crowded, but like I say, it's very, very nice, very relaxing atmosphere. And I just done a shot of the deco inside, which is very, very old, old, really old stone brick. And yes, I'm still melting from the boat. There's a lovely breeze here on such a lovely day in Greenwich. All of this, 12 quid. It's a pint of uh, Coke, pint of uh, lemonade, half a pint of lemonade, cappuccino and double espresso. No bad at all. Marvel France, that's what the spaceship docked in Thor Dark Worlds. <laughs> For only sure the Chrome fans and Paris the Caribbean fans. I see the film the Bean Hall there. <laughs> and of course the Med Medle there's Miz here as well, the movie. And again, there's a better view of the walkway tunnel exit on the other side of the bank, having walked under the Thames.
them in distance. I don't think there are any to do with this. It's past the Naval College. Something came we also do when this is built, is it? <laughs> Food, high and marsh, liquor, gravy, and eels, there, eels, jelly eels, jelly eels. I don't like the eels, but. <laughs> Additional pie and marsh. You know, coming into Greenwich Market. It's got a lot going on today. And this is the half of car show here and bike show here. In the last Thursday of every month, I think it moved to this last Saturday of the month now. Is he going to the market? Yeah. Are you it is empty. Yeah. I wonder if uh, World War II helmet now. More street food down there. Tried the street food before, haven't we? <laughs> Dave did. Yeah, I tried the street food before. Let's just leave it at that. That's the credit market. We go since 1737. The end thing, the end thing at the moment. Now we're going to open a restaurant down in the middle of Greenwich here. Thousand square feet for sale. I might be going crazy, I don't know what to do. My heart is screaming for you, babe. What I'm trying to say is that you make the sky look blue Even when it is grey, babe Every time I'm feeling down You can make it go away Your light is shining bright on me Got no reason to be afraid You're glowing in the dark You're glowing in the dark Glowing in the dark I feel it in my heart you're glowing in the dark, glowing in the dark, yeah, you're glowing in the dark. I can't stop looking at you, you're like a firefly. Guide me out of the woods now. Oh, I think I lost my way, but got you to help me back. Tell me what I should do now Every time I'm feeling down You can make it go away Your light is shining bright on me Got no reason to be afraid You're glowing in the dark 
You're glowing in the dark, glowing in the dark. I feel it in my heart. You're glowing in the dark, glowing in the dark. Yeah, you're glowing in the dark.